Oh, yeah, baby. Hey there, guys, how you all doing? I'm Paul the Tech Giant, and welcome back to the channel, where today we're going to be unboxing and testing out the Oyeet Next Pro Muscle Massage Gun, which is going to be a real handy little product to help with your recovery after those long, hard workouts. Now, we've actually got a couple of these to unbox and test out. We've got one in grey and another one in red. So you've got a couple of colour options there to choose from. And uh, I'm going to be calling upon the assistance of my wife, who is uh, behind the camera recording for me at the moment. But what we're going to be doing is testing out these massage guns on each other. And as you can imagine, it's going to be a right old laugh. Now, if you do like what you see in this video and you want to pick one up for yourselves, then please do me the massive favour of checking out the link in the description and making your purchase through there because I will get a very small amount of commission from every sale that is made. Right, let's first start off with this unboxing then. And uh, if we spin these boxes around, as we can see, we've got one red and one in grey, as indicated on the back of the boxes. But we're going to first start off with the grey. So we've got a, a nice sort of glossy image of the massage gun there on the front. On this sleeve, if we just pull that off, set that to one side. And then we just pull back the top. And yeah, very well presented. We've got this Oyeet sheet just there. And then break through your limits. We just turn this around, gives us some specs on the actual gun itself. So design, there we go. Motor, so it's 98.8 watt. Um, speed, 1600 to 3500 RPM. 460 pounds, pressure sensor, yes. Noise level, 45 decibels. Battery life, that's pretty good, 240 minutes. You know, that's gonna last a fair old time. Uh, charging stand, USB charging, ultra portable, travel case, 1.2 pounds, dimensions and attachments, which are eight. Then we have our user guide. Now, one good thing about this is if I just find the right page, it tells you all about the gun just there, but also all the different attachments, it tells you exactly what they are good for. And uh, we'll be going through each of those when we test these uh, guns out on ourselves. So uh, yeah, we give you a run through of each one of those attachments. But this box or case, I think that looks really nice. This uh, like raised design on there. It's like a hard sort of like rubbery plastic, but soft at the same time. Got a nice strap there at the side, carry handle. Looks the business. Let's pop this open. And there we go. Look at that, really well presented. Love the way that that is all set out just there like that. So we've got all our different accessories or attachments. A little bit of net in there at the side. Let's get the actual gun out itself. And there we go, looks really nice. Nice bit of weight to it, but not too heavy. And uh, just here, it says about the pressure sensor indicator. You can read that yourselves there. So uh, different color indicates on how hard you are pushing and you've got a light just here and that will light up to indicate that different level. And then it also says about the light for the different uh, battery levels. Moving around to the side, and we have our power on off button and that also changes the speed stroke mode that you are using. Then at the bottom, we've got a port there for charging and we also have one attachment already on the gun just there. I do love the way that you can see the motor through the top. I think that's a real nice design. If I just sort of pull that, you can see that moving just like that. And to uh, change the attachments, really easy to do. All you've got to do is just give it a pull and it comes off like that and simply push on another one. So there you go, simple as that. Right, let's next look at these other accessories. So let's just tip this out then and First off, we have 
a charging cable. Feels very good quality. And then we have our charging stand. So if we just put that down there, can plug the cable into that there like that. And it does feel like it's like a suction cup. Just get our massage gun, plonk that on there like that. But if you want, you can actually plug the cable directly into the bottom if you don't want to use that charging base just there. And then finally, we get this lovely strap, which you can just clip onto the carry case. Now, before we actually test this out on each other, I just want to show you guys how you go about operating it. So a single press for about a second will get that muscle massage gun underway. And that is on its first speed. And as you can see just there, we've got a yellow light, which indicates zero to 6.6 .6 pounds, I think it is. And uh, depending on how hard you press, you will see that changing. Then if we press the power button or mode button again, that has taken it to level two. One more press again. Level three. One more press again, level four. Oh, that is really going some. You, you can feel the power in that. I've got to say it for a handheld thing, even before I've actually put it on myself, you can feel the power just pulsating through my hand. And then one final, final press again. If you'll see, that is then pulsing. And what that will do is gradually speed up and down. There you go, you can see that's speeding up again now. Oh, blimey, that is really buzzing through my hand. And then finally to turn it off, if you just do a long press, it shuts it off. Well, let's take a quick look at the red one and the packaging, as you can imagine, is all the same. And there we go. That is the red one. Personally, I prefer the grey, and uh, with that one, you get a red charging dock. Right, now is the part you've all been waiting for, and that is the testing. So, uh, do you want to go first? No. No, you want me to go first. What a surprise. So, uh, attachment-wise, well, um, I'll tell you what, should we just start off with the one that's on the end, which is, which I showed you a minute ago, it's like this solid metal one. It's got almost like a ball bearing in the end there. And uh, maybe start my chest area, do you think? Because, you know, it sort of looks about right for that, doesn't it? So yeah, let's crack on. Right, so first off, I just want to apologise. I'm not in the best state at the moment when it comes to working out. Dislocated my shoulder recently, so I've not been working out for weeks. So yeah, I'm not in the best shape at the moment, but it is what it is at the end of the day. So let's start off on level one. And obviously you would normally do this after a workout, but due to my dislocated shoulder that I did have, I've not worked out yet. But hopefully in the next few days, I'm gonna be getting back into it. So I should be up to a decent size before we know it. And God, I'll tell you what, you can really feel the power in that. If I push hard, we should see that change color. Blimey, Ugh. take me to your leader. Just up that power. Apologies to anyone who doesn't like seeing a bloke with his top off. Please switch off. But, um, you know, best way to show it really, that's what people are gonna do. Just crank it up. That's definitely got some go to it. Ah, yeah. Ooh. Right, that's enough of that one. Let's move on to a different attachment. Right, now it is your turn. So uh, what are you gonna do, do it on your chest? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right, so uh, go on then, pick your poison, which one? I think you should go for that one on your leg, what do you reckon? On your leg, that on. Actually, keep doing that, you can really see that waving through your muscle. Yes, move it down, yes. It really shows up well on camera, that. What's that feel like? Oh, it's alright, it's quite tickly. Yeah. 
I mean, you should be used to like this. Like that, it's gone right down to my foot, I can feel that. Yeah, I mean, you've already got a personal massager anyway, so you should be, uh, <laughs> yeah, well used to this. Not it's already used... as powerful as that, that's for yeah. sure. But yeah, they, you know, that's a great demonstration there, as you can see it, wave it, yeah, pulsating through a muscle there. How about changing up the speed then? Mm. Do I have to? But that moulds quite oh. nicely to your leg, that does, doesn't it? That hurts. That hurts. Yeah. <laughs> you're not used to it, so uh, that's fair enough. But yeah, you can really see that wave in there. For a rechargeable thing. Yeah. This, uh, that I, is I, so powerful. Yeah, that is the thing. I've never oh. felt anything so strong for something rechargeable. Yeah, to be fair, I thought it was going to be a lot weaker than that. Oh, God, no. Is that too much, though, oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> no. Oh, God. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> That's all right, oh, shut it off. Now the one that my partner just tried out is the Air Curved and uh, as I said, gives you a description of what each one does. So simulated tapping massage, simulating hand tapping massage with uniform intensity such as arms, thighs and curved parts. So I think the next one that I'm going to test out um, I'm going to try the soft ball. Now this is uh, greatest surface area, best attachment to start with to narrow down pain points. So if I just quickly, oh no, it's not that one, it is this one there. As you can see, nice soft ball. So good one to begin with because, you know, it's going to be pretty easy going. And I'll just try it on my arm and my shoulder. Don't know how that's coming across on camera. Change up that speed. Yeah, it's quite nice that, because you can push a bit harder and you know, the ball takes up a bit of that pressure. Let's just move down the arm a bit. Oh, oh, yeah. You can really tell when you're at sort of a good spot, if that makes sense. It's sort of pleasure and pain at the same time. And the back of the arm there. Oh, that's lovely, that is. Oh, yeah. I want to go and have a workout now so I can uh, really use it properly. But like I said, because of my shoulder, I'm a bit restricted. I can't believe for the first time that I've actually been sent anything to do with working out. I'm not in any shape the rest of the time. I'm in really good shape, but at the moment, not so much. Oh, blimey, under there. Oh, that's, that's on the border between pleasure and pain, that one. Ooh. So anyway, let's uh, try out another attachment. Right, next, it's your turn again. So this time, I think we should go for um, the bullet. You've already got one of those anyway. <laughs> so uh, we go for trigger. the trigger cone. And that is meant to do, um, use for pinpoint muscle treatment, including hands and feet. What's that feel like? bit sensitive in some of the areas but it's not too bad. Now I'll be totally honest I did crack this out the other week um, before I you know even thought about doing my unboxing video on this because um, I had a bad foot and literally I just tried um, this attachment on the bottom of my foot and I've got to say it it done wonders you know I'm not going to stand here and say it's some medical miracle cure or anything like that that'd be wrong for me to do so but for me personally yeah. it, it done wonders on Actually, my foot the faster that one goes the better it is believe yeah. it or not right anyway let's move on and uh, try out one more attachment right the final attachment that we're going to test out is the fork rounded ends to work around specific muscle groups so that is what the fork looks like. Oh, Jesus. Now, watch the yellow light there if I push harder. Oh, that's going really deep, that is. Ugh. But yeah, I really am shocked at the power that such a small rechargeable device can have. It is pretty impressive, isn't it, to be yeah. fair. Like I said, I've got nothing else to go on, but Blimey, I didn't think it'd be that powerful. Oh, that is good there. Let's just crank it up a little bit more. Ah, let's go full whack. Oh, that's too much. Ooh, ooh. Right, that's it. It's a wrap. 
Now, as I suspected, that was a great laugh testing it out. And I've got to be honest, that exceeded my expectations. What did you think? Yeah, it's, it's quite good. Actually. Yeah, in all fairness, it's really, really powerful. I can't express to you how powerful it really, really is for such a small, compact um, unit that, you know, it's portable. Nice travel case and all that for it. You know, you can't really go wrong. And uh, like I said, if you want to pick one of these up for yourselves, I'll be putting links in the description. And I'd really appreciate if you do use those links because I'll get a small chunk of commission from every sale that is made. Now, if you have enjoyed this video today, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, then please consider doing so. And also, if you'd like to see me do more sort of sporting related tech and stuff like that, maybe workout stuff, protein sort of stuff, then hit me up in the comments section as when I get back into me working out, it's definitely something I wanna consider doing uh, going forward with my videos. So anyway, thanks very much for joining me today and hopefully I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye for now.